So these are three Charlet bull calves that was born here last March. We uh, left them as bulls intentionally. We got two out of the three sold. Um, very well-known uh, farm that their fathers are from, Corner View Charlet Farms out of Pembroke. That's where we purchase all of our breeding bulls. Um, the third one here is to your left, laying down. They're really quiet. They're fit a 13% vintage beef top um, that bring them to their full potential of growth. On outside, Ash, we'll go and show them the herd, or the flock, not the herd, the flock. These girls are going to be lambing anytime. We have about 30, 35 yos all together. Instead of lambing, you have more yos than that. Some of these lambs right here, they were born here in October. We kept back seven yo lambs out of uh, 25 yo lambs, I guess. A lot of these yos are going to be lambing here within the next, so they could lamb today, but within the next month. Beautiful sunny day here today on the Manitoulin, and I'm loving every minute of it. Yeah, you got to take these days as they come. See, that? You see the udders on some of these yos, they're getting really close to lambing. The other night, Ashley, I come to the barn at 2 o'clock in the morning. Ashley came at 5 o'clock in the morning. We had a yo lamb in between. She had four lambs, which is quadruplets. The first two lambs uh, were froze to death by the time we got out here again, and we managed to save two out of the four. Got to check them pretty much on the hour. When it's cold. Yeah. yeah. Over here. Over here we have uh, three cows that just finished up the fall, the fall calvers. The three cows and three calves, and there's one cow laying down right here that's going to uh, that's going to be the first cow to calve this spring. So I'm just keeping an eye on her. I got her in there so I can just judge what she eats. Anyhow, we feed behind, a... here. We got 50 cows. There's 50 cows way back in the bush. We're going to be going to feed them. Going to be going to feed them very shortly. <laughs> My bottom lips froze. I can't talk too good. Anyways, guys, we just wanted to show you the yos and some of the bulls that we have. There will be more videos coming up. It's lambing. Uh, we're going to be calving in March, so there'll be some pretty good videos there. Okay, so when you go up to start that tractor to go feed them cows, don't even try that tractor that's in the garage. Take the Kubota. Yes. The Kubotas are number one. There's two things I don't lend out. One is my wife, and one is the other is my tractor. Kubota.